for about 65% of you, right? Yeah, very nice. And from there, everything we do, 100% the same. Thread the needle, touch the, your nose with the backs of your fingers, and on the count of three, one, two, three. Yeah! There you go, good work. Good Okay, so we let you into a secret with this one. Okay, we're gonna try something else. This is a little experiment with Never really done this before, but let's uh, continue with the next one, Chris. So this sort of follows on from what Scarlett was doing. So in a similar way, what I like to do with your left hand is place your left hand out in front of you with your thumb down. So your palm is facing out to the left. So your left hand, thumb down. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take your right hand, and your right hand is going to go all the way over the top, and you're going to lock fingers. Okay, so all the way over the top and lock fingers. You locked? Now don't let go. And what you're going to do is you're going to rotate your hands just slightly round to the right as far as you can go. You'll probably be able to stop about there before you can go any further, okay? Once you're in that position, you then just go again, and again, and again, and again, until you've done 360 degrees all the way around. How did that go? <laughs> you managed to do that, all right. So, seriously, this is, we really want to find out how many people can do this, so please don't lie, be honest, okay? Put your hand up if you could rotate your arm 360 degrees like Chris. Put your hand up. Nobody! <laughs> Nobody. Okay. Oh, there's one person. Maybe they knew how to do it. So the difference between the last trick that Skylar did and the trick that Chris did was magic theory. The second one was a magic trick. The second one was an illusion. The first one was just a puzzle. Now, we're not going to tell you how this one is done because magicians use that in their shows at the moment, but what we are going to do is we're going to teach you a magic theory, a magic trick that um, professional magicians use and that this is literally what we do with the actors on day one, okay? This is called the French drop. So, on the way in, hopefully, you've been given a coin. So can everybody take out your coin and you can sit down in your seat now, thank you.